I think the, the key to our success is probably just being humble and just taking care of business and just going into every week with a chip on our shoulder and just just keep working, just continuing to work. I love Colorado. I mean, it's a great town, great place. I mean, football's football's on its way back up there. So I mean, it's it's definitely fun. I'm definitely having a great time. Hey, always great to see Steven back there at Del Valle. Uh, we wish him nothing but continued success there in Boulder. UTEP football might not be on the rise, or maybe they are on the rise. It's really tough to tell at this point. The Miners are dropping, uh, dropped to 0-4 following Saturday's loss to New Mexico State. And while that has to be discouraging, you still can't ignore what you've seen so far this year. There's been some improvement. UTEP has been competitive. And they certainly came to life uh, on offense last week against the Aggies. If it wasn't for maybe stupid penalties, a couple turnovers, the Miners win this game. It's time to turn the page, though. UTEP begins conference play this week at UTSA, and head coach Dana Dimmel says this is an opportunity for this team to wipe the slate clean. This is a game that if we play well, you know, we got a good chance to win it, you know, and, and it's a conference game and that's good. And so the guys can see that we're starting to play at a level that we can win these games and win a road game and have a chance. And if we can do that, you know, gosh, you got a ton to play for because you can come out and start off conference play at 1-0. and UTSA has opened, the C, opened this game as a 10.5 point favorite, that is, over UTEP. It will be a 5 p.m. kickoff there in San Antonio.